It's Pelle here from Editing Visuals and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to make the pixel grunge effect in After Effects. And before the video starts I just wanted to let you guys know that I recently launched a new grunge pack and I think it looks very very cool and you guys can get a discount on the pack by using the discount code Pelle. That way you will save $5. But yeah, let's get right into the tutorial here. So we're going to start off in After Effects. And here I've added my clips here I'm going to be using. And after you have added your clips you're going to be using, you're going to start off by making a adjustment layer. And you make that by pressing Ctrl, Alt, Y. Here you get your adjustment layer. And the first effect we're going to be adding is called Noise. And for the noise here, it's going to be pretty simple. We're going to set the amount of noise to 100%. So we will get this look here. And the next effect we're going to be adding is called Mosaic. And here I'm going to set the horizontal blocks to 1000 and the vertical blocks to 150. And after that you're going to be adding Vignette. I'm just going to be increasing the angle of view to 50, just a tiny bit there. And then add Noise again, set it to 25%. After that we're going to be adding transform, here uncheck uniform scaling and then change the scale width to 115. You're going to be adding posterize time as well and here I'm going to change the frame rate to 15. That is optional but I like this kind of laggy look and uh, yeah I think it really makes it more grunge the whole uh, effect here. So this is what we have for the moment. A really really cool effect and this is also optional I would say I'm going to be adding a curves effect to increase the contrast play around with that a little bit but some grunge effects are usually a little bit desaturated so this is also a little optional uh, effect but I like to add curves as I said and then just drag this one up a little bit and then this one down a tiny, tiny bit like that so this is the difference here I think it looks pretty good. Yeah, as I said, it's optional, the curves, the posterized time, but this is how the finished effect is going to look like. I think it looks really, really cool. And uh, yeah, to be able to make this effect with no plugins, it's pretty, pretty cool in my opinion. And if you guys want to save this as a preset, you guys can go to the uh, effects here, press Control A, then you mark all the effects here, animation, save animation preset, and there you're going to save your preset. So now when you search up pixel grunge effect, you guys have it here, you can add it to a adjustment layer or clip layer and you will get the effect here. Really, really cool. And as I said in the beginning, I recently launched a new editing pack called the grunge pack. And I'm going to be showcasing the pack for you guys now. And I'm going to be adding an effect. So I'm going to Press Ctrl Alt Y to make a new adjustment layer and here I'm going to be adding the grunge effect 7. And this is how the effect is going to look. I think it looks absolutely amazing and if you guys are interested in this pack, you guys can go to our website. The link is going to be in the description and you guys can use the discount code Pelle to save $5. Now my camera is almost about to die and I uh, hope I will get the outro here. Uh, <laughs> If you guys like this tutorial, don't forget to like and subscribe and share the tutorial. Don't forget to check out our socials and join our Discord server. And I'll see you guys soon. Take care and have a nice day.